Let's start this match in three, two, one, go. The second we start, we see red cargo in that upper hub, blue cargo to follow, but it bounces out just barely. Human player shot bouncing off the rim for the Red Alliance as the Timberwolves score one more piece of cargo for red. No quintet in this match, but both sides have plenty of firepower to try to get their cargo bonus naturally. Two shots up high for Red Alliance coming from the Timberwolves. They're going to head over to their terminal to grab another piece of red cargo. On the blue side, Power Surge, one ball in, one ball out. Their teammates, the wild cards, get one up high to match them, though, as their other partners, Robo Panthers, are looking for yet another piece of cargo. They want two before they go to line up their shooter, want to be ready to go. Slow but steady, they find their place. Will they be able to get both of them? One in, two in. That is four more points for the Blue Alliance. The Red Alliance has a 10-point lead, but this is still anyone's game. More balls going up for the Blue Alliance. Both, unfortunately, bounce out. One even out of the field. For the Red Alliance, though, we see one ball in from the Timberwolves. Pathfinder Tech, unfortunate bounce out for them. All these robots are shooting high. Power Surge going for the lower hub. Managed to get one there. As the Red Alliance and Blue Alliance score some here, Robo Panthers managed to get their second piece of cargo in. Timberwolves get two in for red. Pathfinder Tech just over the top. Very, very close. 15 cargo for red, 13 for blue. Can any of these teams manage to get this cargo ranking point before the end of the match? Blue Alliance looks like they might abandon the cause as the Robo Panthers start to climb. Mid rung for the Robo Panthers. Now up to high. They're going to climb to high, and now they're going to traverse, and they pull away. On the other side of the field, Hachiko for the Timberwolves is going to high with 15 seconds left. 8709 is trying to as well. If they can do that, that's 20 points for the Alliance. But the Timberwolves have more ambition. They go for the 15-point traverse. That looks like a good 25 points for Red as the match comes to an end. Results ready. It's a Red Alliance win. Three ranking points for Red, one for Blue. That allows the Timberwolves to hold on to that fifth place spot. Unfortunately for the Red Alliance, they were at 19 cargo scores.